season to be proud of was the general consensus among Baggy's supporters. And last night around 900 fans celebrated a West Bromwich Albion's end of season gala dinner held at the ICC in Birmingham. West Bromwich Albion secured another season in the Barclays Premier League with three games remaining and travelled to Newcastle United for their last fixture on Sunday. Yes. Only once in two weeks, home games only. Hosting and presenting awards was Black Country Television presenter and Baggies fan Adrian Charles. Yusuf Malumbu won the award for both Player of the Season and Player's Player of the Season. The most consistent player and I think the one that the supporters have really taken to their hearts is Malumbu. He's a 100% wholehearted individual. He plays with a smile on his face and he's totally committed to the cause. And I think people, that country people, love that commitment and passion. And he's a fine player and he's got seven goals and he comes from Africa and he's better than Kaka. Top goal scorer went to Peter Odin Wingy. And you have to give him full credit for 15 goals in the Premiership season. You know, Chelsea paid £50 million pound for a bloke and he's only got one so far. We paid peanuts for this chap and he's got 15. Simon Cox won goal of the season away at Tottenham Hotspur. Young player of the season went to James Hurst. Supporter of the year was awarded to family members of Steve Dye, who passed away earlier this year. While blind Dave Healy was awarded for his contribution to the community. And enjoying the celebrations is Express and Star video blogger Pete Dankert, who sums up their season. Well, I think there was a firm base put in by uh, Jimmy Taylor, uh, but obviously. Roy Hodgson's come in and he's put that stability in, he's, he's strengthened the defence up for us, he's given us some shape and we still seem to retain the, uh, the attacking flair and ability to score goals, which they always say is the hardest thing in the Premiership, don't they? And not for us! <laughs>